What's up, y'all? It is Wu Tang Clan T shirt day. Uh, some weeks back, Daddy Ivo had the idea, uh, influenced by my collection 7000. 12 12 will be Wu Tang T shirt day, which, you know, basically be a day that several of us YouTubers that are uh, Wu Tang fans will sport our Wu Tang shirts in the video. So here I am showing my support, showing off my most recent Wu-Tang Clan shirt, Killer B on the Swarm, you know, it's how we do. <laughs> now, here's the thing though, 1212, if you guys didn't know, today is also Daddy Ivo's birthday. It's still not too late to go greet him, happy birthday, go check out his channel, subscribe if you haven't already, I'm gonna pop a link up, like right there. Alright, click that. And it being Daddy Ivo's birthday, thought I'd do a special opening party of several of the things that I got from him. If you haven't seen that super dope video, go check it out. So, I'm going to go ahead and start opening some of these things up. Alright, it's the Halo Reach Target Exclusive Spartan Mark V. Let's get this open. I use these uh, wire cutters. Right. Pop that out. DMR right here. Uh, check that out. Really, really cool. Let's check these joints out right here. This, this is pretty much what I do when I first open a figure up. Kind of, you know, get a feel for all the joints. Move everything around. DMR, grenade. Let's throw that aside for now. It is the Pirate Leader Hondo Onaka. Let's crack them open. Rubber bands right there. This is really cool. Nice to finally have Hondo Naga. He's got this cool sword right there. Has his Kawakian monkey lizard pet. And his pistol. Of course he comes with the Galactic Battle Game accessories. So that there for now. Alright, check it out. It is the NYCC exclusive compound Hulk. This thing is so awesome. Take a look at that real quick. All right, let's get these tape seals cut open. Oh, man. Now that I'm looking at this, it's like, oh, do I open this? This is, this is almost mint on seal card worthy. Look at that, look at this. And, um, you know, it's in almost pretty much the same standard Marvel Universe packaging. But there are some differences, especially look at the logo right there. That's very different. Just would not do it justice if I didn't open it, right? There you go. Hope I'm not making you cringe if you're one of those Minos Seal Car collectors. Especially, you know, knowing that it's an exclusive. The uh, figure stand right there. Oh, man. Take a look at that right there. Holy crap, that is just too cool. This figure is just all kinds of awesome. <laughs> what else can I say? I mean, come on, look at that. Compound Hulk. It's regular Hulk and Red Hulk in one. That is just insane. Let's throw them over here and get to the next one. It is another exclusive. This one was also exclusive to NYCC, the Deadpool Core. It's a special four pack. It's kind of like a four and a quarter pack. It's got these four Deadpools, but then it's also got this flying zombie head. So let's go ahead and crack this thing open. Cut these tape seals right here. All right, and then it has this uh, Marvel Mini Mate poster right here. Check that out. That's really cool. And there's a little mini comic on the back too. Let me cut the tape on all these little accessories here so it'll be easier to pull everything out. Uh, there is quite a few accessories here too. Um, I'm not even sure 
which goes to each character. Let's go ahead and pull these out. It's a regular dead pull right there. Pop these little MP5s out. These swords, more swords. And even more swords. All of these ones are like some sort of energy swords. I'm not sure right now who this goes to. I'm gonna have to look that up. And so we've got Kid Pool right here. Then we've got Champion Pool. Particularly like this one, you know. I love the latest <laughs> Lady Deadpool. There's this one. I, I don't know his name, but it's a little zombie. Deadpool head with a little helicopter rotor right there. I think these energy swords go to Kid Pool. I'm going to look them up and see. Um, so there's two pairs of these MP5s. Uh, I'm not sure if there's two characters that sh should have a pair of them or if each one of those should have one. So for now, I'm just going to assume that each one of them gets an mp5 next we've got more deadpool goodness it is that elusive uh comic pack with deadpool and the taskmaster oh man all right let's just tear this open comes with a comic that's pretty cool i'm definitely gonna be giving that a read taskmaster shield this is probably a, a repaint of a captain america shield i'm gonna pull these out carefully. I don't want to risk breaking anything. Uh, knife right here. Another gun. Alright. Let's get Deadpool out. Hey, there you go. Bow is in here really good. I don't want to risk breaking this. Alright. I don't know how to do this. Um. Uh, Alright, I'm going to just try to pull it out of this. There you go. Man, he is in there good. Oh, it's because of, because of the cape right there. <laughs> okay, that was a tough one. Alright, got him out. And one final thing is pistol. Here's a look at Taskmaster. Man, that's a really cool figure. I'm not actually too familiar with the character. Uh, he definitely looks badass though. He's got this bow. I'm going to have to use the uh, heating method to unwarp this bow, straighten it out. And this old school German style pistol right there. And it is all about this Deadpool. Look at that. That is, oh, that is just a thing of beauty. I mean, come on. Deadpool is just such a badass. Um, and he's hilarious. I love how they sculpted the pinky out. You know, really stylized. Got a C for swords back here. That's really cool. Um, this sword that was already inserted is a little bent. I'm going to have to use a heating method on that also. And he also has this knife. Uh, and there's a sheaf for that also. And then for the pistol, there's a holster right there. Uh, get that in. This, this pistol is made of some really, really soft plastic though. Awesome figure. Uh, I, I might have to give this guy a review because I know you can't see right now. You know, I don't got the macro on, but the details are amazing. I love the sculpting in his costume. Really cool. We got one more item here. Got this big, badass 18 <laughs> van. Oh man, so if you guys saw the, uh, the unboxing of all the packages you know this was i ain't gonna get into it in detail go watch the video but i i totally missed out on this before so it was really awesome that ivo was able to hook me up with one let's get the tape seals on this thing cut open uh, instructions right there okay this one's a little tough to get out of the package there we go all right, is there a lot to cut open? Oh, wire cutters on these. All right, so check that out. Oh man, this thing is cool. Let's close this door right here. Let's 
open this one up. And this door opens too. Um, there are some electronic features. Gotta throw some batteries in there, so I'll check that out later. Look at that thing. <laughs> Come on now. How cool is that? If and if you're you weren't a big fan of the 18, but I mean, come on, that was a badass movie. Even if you're a fan of the original show, um, this thing is just a must-have. But like I was saying, even if you weren't a fan or aren't a fan of the 18, if you collect 118 scale stuff, you know, GI Joe and everything in that scale, four inch scale, basically, this is an awesome addition to your collection. Probably even use it for Cobra. Uh, so yeah, you know, doors do open. You can see two figures uh, in the one in driver and passenger. In the back, there's two seats here, and we can see that. There you go. Um, unfortunately, they didn't make it so you can open these back doors. That would have been cool, um, but I think it's due to like the electronics and stuff. Really cool. It is in a great scale. You know, the proportions and size is great for the scale. It's actually licensed GMC and there's even a license plate right there, Ranger 75. Um, that is so cool. So there you have it. Lots and lots of cool stuff, man. These are some great toys. Uh, I'm going to check these out a little bit more later on. Really cool figures though. Once again, look at that. That is just a badass Hulk right there. Totally digging these Deadpool core figures, especially the Lady Deadpool. And then Deadpool himself, I mean, come on, and Taskmaster, this dude is badass, I'm at the Wikipedia him. Man, that Deadpool's badass, you know, I'm probably gonna throw him in this 18 man real quick. Once again, don't forget to go visit Daddy Avo's channel, drop him a comment, wish him a happy birthday, and subscribe if you haven't already. Alright, thanks for watching.